it's JC1424 once again with Saturday Night Speedway. In this episode of the Late Model Series, we're going to be completing week 4 of 13, which is going to take place at Bloomington. Bloomington. A ton of blooming. Quarter mile, semi-banked. Uh, it's one of them open tracks um, without the walls and all that stuff. So this is going to be fun, I hope. Let's go into practice and prepare for another nutty um, Saturday night of racing. Yeah, I definitely remember this place is tiny, and, uh, well, I don't know how to drive this car on the track. I suppose I'm going to have to go in really slow into the turns or I'll just fly off the freaking track because this is a small track and it's a really fast car, but I'll figure things out. <laughs> I feel like I can't fit the car on the track right now, but that's just my first, um, my first glance at everything. All right. I'm just kind of driving around the track the way I feel like I should at the moment. I don't know exactly what to do yet. I never know what to do whenever I first get to a track. Maybe staying at the bottom like that will be helpful. Ran a 12. Oh my God. Let's not do that. Riding the outside, almost flying off the track. I don't know if riding the outside really high through the corners is helpful or not, but we got a 12.16, so I guess I didn't do it right. So our best lap time was 12 seconds. Um, I don't know what I'm going to be required to get in order to qualify well. I don't want to qualify as bad as I did um, last week. Let's get on to qualifying, try to get a faster lap time than we did in practice, and hopefully qualify, um, you know, like at least 7th. You know, because we, we qualified 7th at Charlotte, and I feel like I should be able to do that at other tracks. Did this track get darker while we were away? Or is that just me? Nah, I got darker. I don't know. I got darker during the loading screen. I got, I got evil. Okay, whatever. Let's just push it. Try to make a faster lap time than our, um... Our practice time that we set was 12 seconds. Ugh. Trying to ride the best line I can. Holy shit, fifth place. And that was only a little bit better than our practice time. So I think if we got in our practice time, we would have been able to get seventh and maybe even sixth or something. Uh, then we get a 12 second lap time. I think that's the consistency that we're stuck with is 12 seconds per lap. If we do anything worse than 12 seconds, I guess we're not being consistent. Uh, during the race, we'll probably get slowed down by lap traffic or something. Or hitting other cars will slow us down, so we're probably not going to be able to get 12 seconds consistently. But fifth place, damn, that is our best qualification um, this season. Am I correct? Harrison got the pole, so whoop the freaking do. We can't win a championship because of because of him. If Harrison did not exist, I could win each and every one of these championships. Maybe in the midget series. I don't know. Uh, Code, Valigursky, Thorslin, all them guys. Um, well, Valigursky and Code did not have good races last week, so uh, I can handle them qualifying and finishing better than me this week. I don't, I don't want them to, but I can handle it. Now, Thorslin, he's been a bit consistent, so I am a bit worried about him. Let's get on to Heat 1. Uh, yeah, we're, we're starting on the inside row from qualifying. Um, I think this will start us in third. Let's just go in there, try to make up a position or two, and uh, get a good start in the A main. We are starting in third place, as I assumed, on the inside row. It doesn't matter what row we start on. We're always going to struggle to hold our line at the start of this freaking race. That's one thing I always have a problem with, is holding my line. When the race is start, I'm falling up the track. Okay, so we're still in third. Let's chase these guys chase these guys down and try to finish better than where we started. They're making contact, so that's one way for us to get there. It's a three-car race now. Oh, wait. Whoa, I hit him. Okay, so we got second. Ow. And there's the leader. Ow, he hit me. The guy in the, the orange car. 
So take your orange juice elsewhere. Oh my god. We're still in the lead. I have the race to go. There's a glare getting on my screen. Oh my god, I hate recording this at daytime, but it's like the only time I can record these freaking videos right now. Ow! You know, because my little brother and sister aren't here right now, so I don't have to worry about them making noise. I'm just trying to stay in the lead. Maybe we can win the A main if we can win this one. I don't know. Whenever I started this freaking season, I didn't expect to be able to win any race, not even a freaking heat. But here we are, leading a heat. One lap to go. How many heat races did I win in uh, the Pro Stock season? It was it like three? I know that I won two races in the Pro Stock season. Um, A mains, that is, but I, I don't know about um, heat races. I know that I won some, but... All right. Wow. Was Harrison in here? No, he got on... Wait, no, he should have been in here, right? Because he qual... Yeah, he, he started in first and he finished in fourth. I, I can only hope that his race goes just as bad in the A main and that he falls back even further. I mean, if he finished in fourth in this race, um, he's going to start, like, even farther back than, like, fourth place. He's probably going to start, like, maybe... Seventh or something in the A main? Oh no. Harrison, you, you just. Do you even late model, Harrison? Does this. This this means I'm starting at first? Yeah, I'm starting at first. This is so stupid, but alright then. I, I can work with this. The starts are usually a bit hairy. The, le the guy that was in second, he just freaking slowed down a ton as we uh, came off of turn two. We're going to lead the first lap of the race. I'm going to try to keep it. I mean, even if I lead the whole race, I mean, uh, that's fine. I mean, dominating a race is something that I usually can't do in this game. All right, so now we're catching lap traffic. I just need to not get too uh, caught up with them so I don't lose this race completely. I just messed up that turn. I was going to stay on the outside, but he was on the inside. If I were on the outside, I might fall off the track, so I ain't risking that. I'll stay out of your way, but I'll, I'll take the line that you would rather be on. Okay, I'm starting to get, um, what do you call it? I forgot what it's called. Um, I'm seeing things. What the hell is that thing called when you, when you see things? Like, I think I see car wrecking or something, but it's just something in the infield. I don't know. I'm going to spend like the next two minutes thinking of what the hell this freaking term is and never come up with it. Uh, you probably hear that bus in the background. That's my sister and little brother. They just got home from school. Uh, they don't have school tomorrow because spring break is beginning. Um, keep in mind that this is being recorded like two weeks before it comes out, so yeah. It's not a late spring break. Where I come from, spring break, um, it always happens um, ending with, uh, well, the before, just before spring break, it's like Easter and all that. Or, I don't know how to say it. Like, spring break starts with Easter Sunday or whatever. That's... I always thought it was the best way to have spring break is for it to be based on when Easter is, but I don't know exactly what spring break is based off of for everybody else. I am trying to find my way around lap traffic. This guy's getting in my freaking way. I don't care how red, white, and blue your ass is. Get the fuck out of the way. Ugh. Wow, my lead has been deteriorating because of the freaking lap traffic. It looks like the guys that are on the lead lap behind me aren't having too much of a problem with it because I'm losing my lead. All right. So let's just let's just drive well and and win this race that I never thought I'd be winning whenever I started the freaking video. Get the hell out of the way, you goddamn lap traffic. I should not have to deal with you at all. I mean, they see me go to the inside and then they, they try to get in my way. Why? No, no Ricky Sinhouse Jr. bullshit. I mean, come on, man. Uh there there are no freaking points involved with your position on the track. 
There, there is no stage after this. So you don't have to do this stupid Ricky Stenhouse Jr. bullshit. Okay, we're pulling away a little bit from second place. Only a few more laps to go. That was a horrible exit to turn four. Gosh. Are the AI just not strong in the late model series of Bloomington? Or am I actually good at this track no matter what I do? Oh, this is... This is... So, uh, this is extremely unfamiliar to me. Leading a race like this. Every single freaking lap of it. Get the hell out of the way, you stupid lap traffic. For Christ's sake. You think you matter, but you don't. Only you matter to yourself. And probably the rest of the lap traffic that are in front of you, but... To me, you get out of the way or I will destroy you. Oh my god, I don't even have a second lead anymore. Just a few laps to go. This freaking lap traffic, I swear to god. One more freaking car to pass. Get out of the way. Oh my god, get out of the freaking way, LSU piece of shit. <laughs> purple and gold or whatever. Alright, one lap to go. I don't have any more lap traffic to pass. I gained on that lap time on the guy in front of me. I mean, behind me. I can't even... I can't logic, man. All right. We're going to win our first race of the late model series. I didn't even think I'd be winning one. I hope Harrison finished extremely badly. I, I really hope he did. I, I think he did because he didn't start well, but he might have been able to make his way through traffic. Fast lap of 12.03. I guess I can't run very fast lap times whenever I'm racing, only whenever I'm qualifying, and that's all my focus is just running a good lap time. I didn't even have to focus in this race, so it's probably why I didn't set a new track record. I won the race. Um, I can't see where Harrison finished. Um, he finished in fourth. That's where he finished in the in um, heat one. So, yeah, we definitely have the points lead now because we got a we got a ton of points, and we we won the race. I, I seriously never thought I'd be winning a race at all during this championship. Balagurski second, Thorsland third, Code fifth. Wow. Oh my gosh. And we can go ahead and look at the rest of these. Um, ten cars finished on the lead lap. Oh my gosh, this freaking lap traffic was being a pain in the ass. Everybody was getting my way. How many cars tried to stop me from passing them? Like, like five? Four? I don't know. I wasn't counting. We now have a um, six-point lead over Harrison. This this is a dream. This is this is so unreal. I can't believe what I'm looking at right now. Thorsland third, Code fourth, uh, Valigersky fifth, Flansburg sixth, Bassett seventh, um, and Francis an eighth. And then you get the rest of the point standings for you guys to look at. A four-way tie for last place. What the hell? Someone please tell me, is, am I improving or is the late model series actually not as difficult as the pro stock series? I, I am really confused right now. I've been confused all my entire life. But, oh, whatever. That, that's beside the point. Next week, we're going to Las Vegas. Um, I remember this was one of the races that I won that in the pro stock series, um, the A main. I actually think I won the A main in that one, didn't I? I don't remember. Uh, it's a half mile track, semi banked. Oh my gosh, so many of these tracks are semi banked. But that that will be week five of thirteen. Thanks for watching this episode of the Saturday Night Speedway Late Mile Series. See you next time. That's that and episode over.